What's up everybody, it's Matt from The House, and in this video we're gonna show you a few of our favorite boot dollar stretchers for the 22-23 season. Let's check these out. And so first up, we've got this Chamonix Caden. So great price point boot, super, super plush cuff on this thing. Very, very comfortable. It honestly feels like you're wearing just a little bit stiffer high top shoe. So you basically get that shoe comfort, but obviously you get all the support that you need from a boot. Nice grippy rubber outsole on this thing, and it's actually very, very flexible, so you get really, really good feel for your board and for your bindings. And we're doing a standard lace system on this thing with that extra piece at the heel, so you can fully customize the lacing on this thing, but we've got that heel piece that actually really, really locks in your heel no matter what you do with the lower part and the upper part of the boot. All right, next up from Evol, we have the Logo Boot. And from women, it's actually called the Love, but very, very similar boot in men's and women's versions. We've got a really, really comfortable boot, standard lace system on this thing that really wants to lock you in. You can really customize a little bit of that articulated cuff so you actually get a little bit better flex when you lean forward on it. Rubber outsole that's very, very grippy on this thing. We actually got that directional tread so you basically get the grip where you need it, the flexibility where you need it. Really just get an all around good feel. And then nice stiff back stay on this thing too. So when you are going side to side, you are getting a little bit more support, but you still get all the flexibility that you need if you're riding park and you tweak out your grabs. And then on the inside, we've got this super, super cushy liner that basically wraps right around your foot and gives you that perfect fit no matter what your foot is shaped like. All right, and then next up, we've got the DC Phase, which this boot has been in DC's lineup for a long, long time and there's a reason it has. It's actually a super, super comfortable boot. At this price, you're actually getting a lot of really, really nice features. You're getting the response liner on this thing, which is a heat moldable liner. You can really customize how this thing fits right to your foot. It is a standard lace boot, and we've got that ankle hold down. So the cool thing is, is no matter what style of riding you're doing, you can really custom lace those three different lacing zones and get this thing set exactly the way you want it. But of course, having that one part at the ankle really allows you to crank that ankle in, which is the part you always need to have nice and snug. And then in addition to that, it's insanely lightweight. This thing is just as light as most of their skate shoes. It has that bloom outsole, which is a foam outsole. It's actually a little higher density foam. So when you feel it, it actually feels a little bit stiffer. But again, it is a foam outsole. So you get a lot of cushioning and you get a lot of grip. But the main thing is they're using some textiles on this thing to help keep the price down and basically give you that one boot that you can ride everywhere, but it's not gonna break the bank. And then last up, one of my favorite boots of all time, the 32 Lashed. This thing has actually been one of the best selling boots in the market for years. There are men's and women's versions of this boot. It does come in a dual boa and it also comes in my favorite, the standard lace. So it's kind of a mid range when it comes to pricing on boots, but this is that one boot that whether you're a beginner or an advanced rider, you're absolutely gonna love it. Nobody hates this boot. It's got kind of that mid flex that's soft enough for the park, stiff enough to ride all mountain. And one of the coolest features is this side panel where the lacing is actually attached to this panel that it's actually sewn in down a little bit lower. It's not sewn in up at the top. This way when you pull the laces tight, these can stretch around your foot and lash your foot into the boot. But again, if you need a little bit higher end boot, you demand a little bit more performance, a couple extra bucks from the cheaper boots, and this thing's gonna last you a long, long time and give you the performance that you need. All right, so when it comes to snowboard boots, when you spend more, you get more. It doesn't necessarily mean that it's better, it just means that it's different, it's got more inside of it. But these are a few boots that can actually help stretch that dollar for you, depending on what your budget is. If you got any questions about these boots or any of the boots that we have at thehouse.com, definitely leave some comments down below. We're on there every single day trying to answer your questions. We wanna make sure we can get you into some rad gear, but most importantly, we wanna make sure that it's actually gonna fit you and it's also gonna help fit your budget too. Also make sure to like, subscribe, definitely get that notification bell on too so you can find out when all the new videos drop, grab yourself a new set of boots and get out and ride because any day riding is a good day of riding.